Hello everyone, welcome to a Foreign Farming in the Philippines. I'm down here looking things over at the Azola pits. Checking to see how everything's doing. Really can't tell one way or another what those tea bags are doing in this pit. It's still not uh, growing that fast. It does need some kind of this it needs something. Because it's just not looking that great. It's not looking bad, but it's not this Azola has been in here for over a week. It should have completely filled it up now. So, while we had a, a excess of nutrients before, which was killing the azola, now we have a deficiency, which is keeping it from producing like it should. So now we got to find that sweet spot. I'm going to come down with a test kit tomorrow, and I'm going to check pH. And Many have been asking why, why, why I haven't been testing the water in these pits. Because when I tested the water in the tilapia pond and the old worm pit, they were both the, the readings from both were about the same and they were off, off the scale on basically everything. So my faith in that test in that test kit just went out the window. They didn't show much difference at all but me and Gina are gonna have a project tomorrow I'm gonna to get like 15 little bottles I'm not gonna do every pit I'm gonna do this pit that's producing well well enough it's not producing well I wouldn't say but it's not doing bad and I've been taking a Zola out of it every day and putting it in these other pits uh, the Zola that's in the pit to the right and to the left of this one is doing okay So what I put in there, this I, I put all this in yesterday or day before yesterday. I can't remember, and that one was yesterday. So this one was day before yesterday, and it's doing okay. So I'm going to test. I'm going to test the. I'm going to bust out the test kit and see if I can get some varying numbers in these different pits because I know the. I know the water quality is different uh, from the beginning pits and these are down here. But I'm going to I'm going to test the water in that pit that the producing pit that we've been putting everything else in the the pit that we've been using to restock the other pits. That's what I'm trying to say. I'm going to test the water in that and kind of use that as a sort of a baseline. Uh, I know it doesn't have enough fertilizer in it. But at least I'll know when things are getting out of hand. Now the azole in this pit is actually looking, even though it hasn't filled it up, I don't know, it's, maybe it's hard, it's not coming up on the screen, maybe it's hard to say. This is a much deeper green. <laughs> and I know that uh, this pit has more fertilizer in it than that new one down there because that new one has zero. So I know that this pit has some sort of residue in it from before. I haven't exchanged the soil, I've just put in new water. And this is all new water. So whatever was in the soil is, is making this much greener. It's a darker green. Well, the, well, the, the producing pit is kind of a pale lime green and I'm sure that that is nitrogen these pits are basically draining themselves because the tarps 
are in such bad condition. So there was a Zola in this pit and it's not growing much either. Although it is that nice dark green. I need to get some, I sent Tata to get gas like two hours ago and he's not back yet. I need to get a little bit of water going into these pits, into the beginning pit there, and fill these up. And I need to get Rainiel down here tomorrow and get all these corn stalks out of here that have fallen in. This pit down there, that's the azole I put in yesterday in this pit and it's doing well. So these two pits here doing okay. These are the ones that I put azole in What's in those pits down there is just leftover, basically just what didn't die and is now coming back on its own. So, the Zola continues to progress. I'm going to get my little scoop. Oh! What, is somebody following me around? What are you doing, Charlie? Oh, I like that hat. <laughs> Oh, he's sleeping. Sleepy boy. That hat's about a year or two big for him. No, no. No. The buyer's there? Okay. Tata is not there. Well, where did Tata go? I don't know. Can you look in here, please? You never been here before? Well, watch where you're going. This is one giant tripping hazard here. Wow. Very big. It is very big. We need to cover this. We do need to cover it. You are correct. Well, see, look all the leaves on. There's a lot of water in this. That bamboo that you see down there is about five feet. And now there's three feet of water over that, maybe even four. So there's almost nine feet of water in this well. Whoa. Can I jump there and swim? You could, but you'd probably have to it'd probably be a good idea if you put Charlie down first. Yeah. <laughs> I'm sure. Oh there's a stairs. I can go down, swim. Yeah, maybe it's only three feet over that. This is very big well. It is a very big well because we need to get a lot of water out of it. Yeah. That was the that was the plan. That's very nice. See? See? Because I told you before. I told you before. This place has a has a good water. And I don't understand why they dig there. Yeah, it's all the same water level, love. It's all the same water. Because we the 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 septic tank. There, yeah. Huh? It's like how many feet is that? It's like five feet, I think. Yeah. There's a lot of water already. Mm. 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 <laughs> <laughs> Come on, baby, let's oh, jump. Charlie's very tired. I know. I I want him to get tired. Anyway, I'm gonna get my scoop. See if I can find it and move around some of this azola. I don't have Tatai's phone number. I never have had it. So don't ask me to call him. Gina, Gina. Gina says she's called him several times. I don't know. I don't know what happened. They're missing in action. The waiting. The waiting. <laughs> the buyer is waiting. Yeah. Well, why right. you very deep there? Oh. That's going to be the storage pit. The water storage pit. Uh, well, actually, yeah, we can put tilapia there. Yeah, they are just growing all very tiny. Ah, Charlie can swim here. It's not deep. This pit, well, it's going to be about another one foot deeper than it is now. Mm. Because this pit, these last two pits, 
Tatai wasn't judging very well. It, it's deceptive because that road goes uphill mm -hmm. and this field also goes uphill to the right. Mm -hmm. And so these pits are higher. The bottom of this pit, you can see it clearly. Well, yeah. The bottom of this pit is higher than the top of the water in this next pit. So there's no way to get water from that pit into this pit unless you pump it in. And I don't want to pump it in. I want it to flow in. So this one has to be dug down another six inches or so. And that one probably eight inches. And we get down eight inches in this one. Then we're only going to we only have a foot of water draining into the storage pit. So it's got to go down another at least one foot. Maybe two. And the corn is growing good. The, the corn, corn is growing good. Yeah, this is Zola water does good. Yeah. 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 Before we plant here. Before we planted here, it was hopeless. We, we did fertilize, but there's nothing like natural fertilizer. That it's not growing like this before, right? Right. It wasn't anything like this. What we planted. I mean, look down here, lab. I don't know. It's been like three months since you've been down here, huh? What? It's been so long that these pits in the beginning down here need to be redone. When I was here, you were just fixing, you were just doing this, this part, I think. Well, that's that's a while ago. Yeah, this one. You were just doing that. I remember that. that I, you and that I just... Yeah. Wow, there's two ears of corn on this stalk. Oh, that's very really big. Two big ears. I think that corn is ready, love. Do you think it's ready? Mm, they're old. They're, they're, they're old. Oh, 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 calm down, woman. <laughs> I'm tired. Oh, so you want corn. Oh, yeah. So I think I've got the water thing figured out. We're going to have to start redoing these pits with bamboo. That's the only way to do it. What do you mean bamboo? You put bamboo. Just like we did those pits on the other end. Thank you everyone. Please like, comment, share, and subscribe.